YouTube, what's good? I personally want to thank you guys for checking into the latest installment here, I Wear Diodorus, hosted by none other than yours truly, Mr. S8000 is King, Don Diodora. Ooh, fellas, I got a good one for you guys today. Highly anticipated review of the latest collab project between LC23 and Diodora, which is part of the Diodora 70th anniversary collection, the Diodora Heritage, N9000 Sock, Terra, and Saturno. Okay, so first up, for the first part of the Discuss and Dissect of this pack will be N9000 Sock, Terra, Mother Earth. I mean, such a clean pair, and a pair that I was highly anticipating because if you didn't know, I'm a huge fan of the pony hair. I love the pony hair on the Diodorus, the way they execute it. I mean, it's just super clean, and it gives it that aesthetic feel that you don't get with much other materials. All right, let's jump right into it. Here you can see the pony hair on the, in, on the outer panel and the inner panel. Then on the Diodora logo, you can see how to use the full grain leather to represent the water. Then on the toe box, you can see the perforated toe box, it's perf leather. Then on the toe wrap, you can see it has that deep, deep blue, sort of like a royal blue toe wrap. The suede is really good. I mean, it's rough. It's not premium, it's a little rough, but still, I mean, it's a must have pair. All right, so next we go to the heel counter where you see all the earth tones. And another thing that pops out, of course, is the embroidered planet on the heel counter. Also, which a lot of guys don't miss, is the embroidered Diodora logo on the side of the heel counter. Next, we go back, you see the Achilles counter, you can see the two types of leather that they use. They use the earth tone leather, and they use the water leather again, a water tone leather again, with the white piping, and then the neoprene sock liner. Now, cool thing that I like about this neoprene sock liner that sets it apart from a lot of other models that use it, is that it's actually all the way down to the footbed, but not attached to the insole. Cool little touch that I like as opposed to other models that have that sock liner. No, 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 <coughs> no, no, no. <coughs> Sorry guys, let me, start, let me get back into this review. <laughs> Last but not least, you have the laces, which is two, two different lace options. I don't have the other ones here because we was actually shooting this pair. But as you can see on the lace tips, they have branded lace tips on both sides with LC23. Okay, so last but not least, second half of the Discuss and Dissect, which is probably the more coveted pair out the pack, which is probably a lot of people were gunning, a lot of more people were gunning for this pair instead of the first pair. And it is the N9000 Sock Saturno, the Rings of Saturn, as you can see here on the heel counter. We'll start from the heel counter first. Heel counter, you can see the embroidered Saturn with the Rings of Saturn on the heel counter, as well as the Diodora logo embroidered on the side as well. Here you can see the different shades of corduroy that they use, burnt orange, you have that sunflower yellow, the olive green, you have the cotton candy blue, and then they didn't use corduroy on the Diodor logo, they used the full grain leather, which is like, sort of like a cotton candy pink. Also on the toe box, you can see the white corduroy, and on the side, you can also see the, the hits of cream corduroy. Here, as a lace option, I decided to go with the laces from the Highly Addictive, which was the rope with the, mint, with the hits of mint green on it. I just figured, you know, it will set the sneak off right. Another thing about this sock liner I thought that was cool was it was sort of like it kept with the theme of the sneaker or the theme of the pack. I mean, I wasn't a fan of, of the sock liner at first, but once you get them in hand and you put them on and you walk around with them and you take some nice pictures, I mean, it's, it's just the added nice piece, a nice touch to it. Again, on the, on the collar lining on the inside, you have that cowhide leather. And again, with the same as the first pair, the neoprene sock liner, it's actually going all the way down into the footbed, but not attached to the insole. Okay, there you have it, guys. The latest review video here, I Wear Dead Doors. I hope you guys were excited about this pack, as I was. I mean, a lot of you guys weren't feeling maybe one pair over the other. I mean, I had to have both, as you guys can see. Um, a lot of you guys were mocking this for the Sean Wortherspoon. I mean, this is the number one corduroy pair this year. I don't care what nobody say about it. Nike, Sean, whatever. Don't at me. All right, this is the number one corduroy pair this year. I don't care what anybody else say. LC23, Diodora Fisher knocked it out the park this year. And in case you guys don't know, be on the lookout for the next two pairs that's gonna be dropping from LC23, which is the two mid baskets, Mars and Moon Landing. I'm sure you guys have seen images. If not, you can go to the IG at I Wear Diodoras and see the images, the official release date. Um, I think it should be dropping on the 21st, which I'm, if I'm not mistaken, is next week. Stay tuned to the platform. I wear, I wear their doors on IG. Stay tuned for more content being pumped out of here. 
Also, stay tuned for the IGTV. There's going to be some content coming up on there soon. I with the doors. It's no hype. It's a lifestyle. <laughs>